Hey there, Leslie Hughes, principal of Punch Media. And I'm often asked the question, what is the point of Twitter? I mean, it seems a little nonsensical to be using short bursts of information in 140 characters in order to convey message, build relationships, and convert sales. But those of us that are using Twitter really love Twitter, and it really has become a tool that I have met um, people online that have become real life friends. So like you, I first went online, I thought that it was stupid, I didn't understand how it worked or some of the, the etiquette or the, the ways that, that people are connecting on Twitter. But as I started to use it in order, as a, as a research tool, as, as I started to use it and I started to use uh, the tool in order to follow conversations and to jump in with conversations with people that I wanted to get to know, I found that it was a really great tool uh, to help me convert sales. And so I invite you, if, if your audience is on Twitter, if you think that this is going to be a viable channel for you, to spend a little time creating your profile, building out your bio, using your personal picture as your avatar and to to connect with people that are potentially within your audience and also some new prospects and provide great content drive traffic back to your site and just engage and have fun with it so Twitter is somewhat like a water cooler there's a two-way conversation that is happening but in the past when we knew that that uh, information was being shared from one to person to one person Social media, as Brian Solis, who wrote the book um, WTF, which is What's the Future of Marketing, and a few other great business books as well about social media, he said that what we're doing with social media is that we're having a one-to-one -one to relate one-to-one -one relationship, but we're actually reaching many. So Twitter is a public forum within 140 characters that people are using to to connect with other people, to use it as a as a customer service uh, point for customer service for advocacy for um, all sorts of different ways in order to keep your business top of mind, to showcase yourself as an expert, and just to connect with a whole new audience at large. So I invite you to take some time to build out your profile, add a personalized picture as your avatar, and to start connecting and making new friends on Twitter. And the statistic says that you should be tweeting about four times per day in order to really gain momentum and to, to get a new following. Now I want you to take action now. There's, to simplify the process of Twitter, it can boil down into three simple steps. Twitter's a lot more complicated than this, but just to keep things simple, the first step is I want you to build out your, per, your profile. I want you to use a photo, not your logo, and I also want you to add a short bio and also your, some of your company information, including your website address. Step two is to build your network. So you can use the Twitter tool uh, that you can bring in email addresses. I want you to follow your prospects. I want you to follow some of your clients and even connect with people in your industry. Step three is to start tweeting away. Now, ideally, you want to have this integrated with your overarching content strategy, and you want to be driving traffic back to your website sometimes, but it's an 80-20 rule of providing great content to solve problems for your audience and also driving traffic back to your, your blog or your website, um, which will ideally convert sales, but you don't want it to be too salesy. You want to really give great content 80% of the time and sell only 20, 10 to 20% of the time. There's a lot more to Twitter, and I look forward to uh, connecting with you in order to help you learn about how to navigate through this channel. Uh, but I just wanted to give you some top tips, and if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to let me know. You can also follow me on my, um, sign up to the newsletter at punchmedia.ca and get online so you can get a lot more information and tips just like this one. So I look forward to connecting with you soon. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll talk to you next time. Thank you.